Hi there, I'm Ken Block, and this is my 1965 Ford Mustang Unicorn. This car was built specifically to do the Gymkhana 7 video. And it is the most fun car I have ever driven. So uh, let me give you a little tour. All right, well, the original vision behind this car was that I wanted to put an all-wheel drive system like I use in my Ford Fiesta in something that was unexpected. So I came up with the idea of doing it with a vintage car, but specifically wanted to do a vintage muscle car. So I really enjoy the lines of the 65 Mustang, especially the notchback. I think it looks very, very tough. This design came from months of developing it with uh, Von Gittin Jr. of RTR Mustangs. And uh, yeah, very, very happy with, with the way the, the concept turned out uh, on a visual sense, but also internally mating a uh, Roush Yates Ford V8 engine with an all-wheel drive system was a really a big engineering task. And uh, the guys at uh, RTR and ASD, the shop that built it, did an exceptional job of engineering the whole project. Uh, one thing that you'll notice uh, in the videos and in photos is the engine sits very far back uh, in the hood of the car. Reason being is that the engine is quite big and it's also sitting quite low. And with the all-wheel drive system, we have a front diff that drives uh, the power out to the wheels and uh, that had to sit up here. So the engine either had to sit over it or the engine had to be moved back to handle that uh, powertrain coming up here. So all the bodywork on this car was all done by hand, especially these very big fender flares. We designed everything in the computer, uh, but when it comes to actually putting it on the car, because it's such an old car, we needed to do it all in person and by hand. So ASD hired a, a very good gentleman that came over and handmade all the molds for this right on the body. All right, so on the interior, we have a lot of the uh, very typical useful items, such as a steering wheel. It's a six-speed sequential gearbox. And of course, we have a very beautiful Hoonigan handbrake here. All right, well, that is it. If you'd like to see this thing run in person, come to the Jim Connor Grid Final this fall. Time to make loud noises.